Greetings from Christchurch, New Zealand in the shadow of the Southern Alps as the eighth mini tournament in this season's Pro League continues on a special Anzac Day meeting at the Napuna Wai Hockey Stadium between Australia and New Zealand and getting us underway are the women here in the Garden City. So Australia get this Anzac Day FIH Pro League match underway in the green and gold, attacking the goal away to our left-hand side. From the other day against Great Britain, there's turnover ball, good closing down by Kelsey Smith. Smith into the circle, and the chance falls to New, Ze to New Zealand, but they can't take it. Black arms nearest to us, Olivia Merry on the far side. It goes to Crowley. She'll slap this. Yeah! Look at that deflection, and it's in. And it's Shannon, the skipper, who deflects it up and into the roof of the net. And it's New Zealand who have the lead here in Christchurch. Six minutes in, New Zealand one, Australia nil. A really well worked short corner routine. Nothing that Joss Bartram can do about this one. So, oh my Plays it forward, ball across the circle, and they're just getting in each other's way here. Oh, Willicks and Shannon. Removed. Oh, New Zealand under pressure, and they've lost possession. And here's a chance. Oh, that's a great save. Courtney shut out with a chance to equalise. And again, they've lost possession. And again, they will look to try. Oh, that's a terrible ball. And uh, Johanna makes another save. It's still there. And then a great defensive effort from Thompson. Cross, that's a foot. Be taken. Oh, they've gone to sleep here. And that's dangerous as Hayes lifted into Poe. Uh, New Zealand just switched off. Left-hand side, Squibb on the right. Goes to Fitzpatrick, and Hanlon is back into the middle. And New Zealand get it out of the circle for the time being, but here come Australia once more. Malone going to fall on the left to Griner and Daw. Norton trying to get it out for the shot, finds the pass. Goal bound to Hanlon, gets it trapped under her feet. And then gets it clear. It gives New Zealand the free hit, which Thompson wants to take quickly. Into the circle it comes, got to get the shot away, they can. Stopped in front of the goalkeeper by Shand. Gets the return pass, Malone. The circle. Space on the reverse stick. Oh, it's in! I think they're just going to check this. Uh, who's hit oh, that one? For me, it's inside. Okay. That is inside the circle, and it's not back sticks. That is some finish from Madison Brooks. Sure. No clear reason to change your decision. They go. So Madison Brooks so. with her so first international it. goal, yeah. and that is what she is not going to forget into Callum Sanders, still going Callum Sanders, Callum Sanders into the circle, across the face of goal, here is Malone, Malone raises off to Lawton, oh, and the touch was there on the far side. Across the field it comes to uh, Wilson, who's in space, Wilson to the far post. Well, the two of them are all in a line. Wilson. Still going to the far post. Callum Sanders still there. Hayes under the keeper. Callum Sanders battling. And New Zealand get it clear. Griner into the circle. Hit the chance. Great save. Fulham is in. And with 2.24 remaining on the clock, Australia have got themselves in front. It was a brilliant first save from Brooke Roberts. But the follow-up, I think, from Abigail Wilson has found the roof of the net to uh, give Australia the victory inside the final 
10 seconds. There is the final hooter and New Zealand are defeated, having led for 49 for 43 minutes. They concede two fourth quarter goals. The final score in Christchurch New Zealand 1, Australia 2.